Hello everybody, I'm GG and welcome back to this tutorial series and in today's episode we are going to take a look at event priority. So as you can see we're inside the on player interact entity eGUI plugin and what we are going to do is we are going to add two more event handlers. So uh, we are going to add an event handler over here and it will be the same kind of event handler as this one only that it will just be on player interact one and then we are going to add one at the end over here as well and we are going to call that on player interact two now what do i want to do i want to uh, check if e dot is cancelled so we want to check if the event is cancelled and i'm going to explain why i want to check that in a second and then we're just going to do e dot get player dot get dot send message and then we want to do the event was cancelled else we want to send a message was not cancelled so uh, just copy this and paste it over here on the on player interact to event uh, what we now want to do is actually change the order in which these events are event handlers are called because what I want to do is I want to on player interact I want it actually to be called as the first so what I'm going to do is after the add event handler I'm going to do open brackets and I'm going to type in priority and then equals event priority dot lowest and as you can see over here there's high highest low lowest monitor and normal normal is just normal it's in between it's low the the order of calling is lowest low normal high highest and then monitor i will uh, explain why monitor uh, is important and what you should and what you shouldn't do over here so i'm just gonna call this lowest so it's gonna call the first and as you can see on player interact entity event e this will return e get player send message the event was not cancelled because we did not cancel the event yet and then over here it's just going to be priority equals normal so um, we are not going to change anything and then over here i'm going to set priority equals event priority dot monitor and what's so special about monitor it's called last and there's uh, like a rule that when you are uh, using event priority dot monitor you cannot change anything about the event anymore it's just monitoring the event so uh, you cannot say oh it's cancelled over here because that will break other plugins because other plugins might use the monitor event priority it will completely break those and just don't do it monitor never change anything about the event only monitoring and over here lowest will call first then the normal then the monitor so what we will see in a second on the server is that this one will say the event was not cancelled then this will call it will cancel the event open the inventory and then this one will call just monitor and it will send the message that it was cancelled and that's how uh, event, event priority works keep in mind never change anything about the event in the monitor priority and let's go take a look at this in the server see you over there so inside minecraft now i've started the server and let's go take a look at the event priority handling and as you can see i've still uh, got the little chicken zombie over here and when we right click it uh, you will see the event was not cancelled the event was cancelled and it will repeat itself because player interact uh, entity or at least every interact uh, so the player interact event as well will call for both the main hand and the off hand over here right click as you can see the event was not cancelled uh, because I uh, when flying I clicked on the chicken instead of the zombie and that will not cancel the event and as you can see this will um, cancel the event and that's it for today's episode I hope you enjoyed if you did leave a like if you want to see more subscribe if you've got any feedback or suggestions down below in the comments or in the description box there's a link to the discord channel hope to see you there thanks for watching